Welcome to Simple Review, the series where I briefly play a game, review it, and keep it simple. If at any point you find this review to be helpful, please consider leaving a like and subscribing. Now in this review, I'm covering the free DLC for Mighty Goose. This DLC adds one new mission and is accessible after completing the campaign. Once loading into the game, you will be informed of the mission on planet Seto. An enemy called Baron has attacked the planet and it's up to you to stop them. This will take you through four different areas throughout the mission. You have your classic run and gun areas, a surfing area, a submarine area, and a final boss. You will have full access to your armory to customize your goose however you see fit to take on this mission. Now from my experience, I'd have to say I was a little disappointed with this DLC. It was neat to see different concepts brought into this game like the surfing and the submarine, but beyond that, the gameplay got pretty repetitive. The surfing and submarine sections were tedious and unenjoyable. In addition to this, you can't play in co-op for those sections, so if you played this game with a friend, they will have to sit out for a majority of this DLC. The highlights of the DLC for me were easily the run and gun combat in the water and the final boss. Fighting in the water often challenges you to fight vertically rather than fighting horizontally, so that was a good twist. The boss battle offered really engaging and fun mechanics for you to master in order to beat the boss. So with all that being said, I'd have to give this DLC 6.5 pepperonis out of 10. I really wanted to like this DLC, but I felt like the content that was added wasn't enjoyable and hurt the co-op experience. It's free though, so check it out if you've already completed the game. And that'll do it for this review. Comment below if you have any questions, and I will try to help.